I am Nathaniel Deal, and this is a short video of how I created my Nerf Blaster Dark Counter. Starting with the counter, here is the seven segment LEDs. There are two of them. They are connected using 14 resistors that are then connected to these shift registers from SparkFun. And those are then powered by the Arduino, which is here. This is what it looks like. The Arduino is only using three pins to power all seven of these LEDs, 14, sorry, of these LEDs. And this is done because of the multiplexing that is happening in between these shift registers. It allows me to send more signals, save signals, and push signals without using all of the ports on my Arduino. So the Arduino is connected to the power source, which is an ultrafire. It is connected in series with a switch to turn it on. And that then powers the two infrared emitters and detectors that are put into this barrel. So I drilled a hole through the barrel and added the emitter and detector. So they constantly send a beam, infrared beam to each other. And when, when that is broken, it tells the Arduino that it's been broken and count down. So I'm gonna turn this on. You can see the dart counter is set to 25 because that's how many darts I am using in this blaster. The blaster is under construction and will be done in a couple of days. Um, I will also be rewiring this thing so it's a lot prettier. Uh, so here's the counter, here's the barrel, and if a dart goes through the barrel, it counts. So, that's kind of how everything works. There's also another port here that I could connect to the reset button, which is located in the blaster at the bottom. It's one of these guys, similar to this. And once you put the clip back in, and this gets compressed after being decompressed for longer than a five seconds or so, then I can reset this counter. So technically when this goes to ground, it will, be reset. Looking for a ground here, but I don't think I have one. May not, may use it, not sure. But this is the setup, and I will be providing another video soon on the finished product. Thanks for watching.